Welcome to Comedic Cooking. It's your host, your boy, Tony Cook. I'm Zane Joyce. I'm Alan Sesson. Today we're making buffalo chicken dip. It's a very good dish and let's get to it. Okay, remember, always be safe when cooking. And also, quick note, we are in a new location today because my floor is being changed. But until then, we'll be in this location. It's pretty nice. It you know. is actually a very nice kitchen. We enjoy it quite a lot. They have a very fancy oven. And that's all the time we have today. Goodbye. The materials you will need to make this buffalo chicken dip is a bowl, pan, and a stirring spoon of your choice. Alright, now the ingredients you're going to need is a little rotisserie chicken. You can get it cooked from like a store or somewhere, or cook it yourself. Doesn't matter. Some two packages of finely ch shredded cheese. And once you're done making the buffalo chicken dip, you should get some chips to enjoy. You don't want to just eat it with a spoon. You're also going to need cream cheese. You also need ranch and hot sauce. The first thing you want to do is set out your cream cheese to soften, but you might have to microwave it for about 30 seconds so it softens quicker. Alright, so this step is where you take your rotisserie chicken and you start shredding it and then putting it into the bowl. So next up you're going to take a cup of ranch, a cup of hot sauce, and half a cup of cheese and put it all into the mixing bowl that you put the shredded chicken into. But you could also do one cup of cheese over half a cup, if you prefer it. So your next step is to take your cream cheese, cut it up into bits to make it easier to stir, and then you want to put it into your bowl. And stir. And stir. steps. You want to mix everything together well. Don't worry about it. if there's a few spots of cream cheese left. It doesn't really matter. You want to take it and put it into a casserole dish. And then once it's all in, cover the entire thing with cheese. Of the shredded variety. That's why you have two bags of it. And your next step will be to put it in the oven for about 20 or so minutes or until the cheese on top is cooked. And you want to do it at the temperature of 375 degrees. Enjoy. From our family to yours, comedic cooking. <laughs> Bye. Oh,
Today we made buffalo chicken dip. It, it came out pretty well, I think. It's a really good dish. You guys yeah. should actually try it. It's pretty yeah. awesome. It's called chicken crack. No, it's not called that. It's buffalo chicken dip. This is comedic cooking. Have a good day. Hope you guys have enjoyed. Like, <laughs> comment, subscribe, all the above. Tony just died. Chicken crack. <laughs> we'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye. Peace out. Bye. That's actually a that's actually like a baking term. It's like crack. I think that was a good. That was a good cheese. Yeah, right I know. Yeah. Why was it skipping?